That's awesome. But, but thank you so much. I just want to introduce you guys to the folks who made today happen. Uh, we have been planning this for uh, almost a year, basically since, uh, well, yeah, last year. Um, and I'll just name everybody off and we'll applaud them. Uh, Carly Beard, Deb Smith, Ken Nahigian, Nick Gray, Becky Mark, uh, Susan McLean, Mashariki Lawson, Tom Eichelman, Bill Potts, Eileen Ferber, Ray Howard, Kaylee Pontiff, and of course, Marie Bain and me, David Diskin. One of the traditions that was started back 15 years ago was to build a free thinking gallery. And have you guys had a chance? I know it's been a little bit wet lately, um, but has any, uh, anyone had a chance to see that maybe when you came in outside? You like that? It's an opportunity for us to recognize all throughout history those who have in some way embodied the idea of free thought. Doesn't necessarily mean that they're an atheist or agnostic, maybe they're even religious. The idea is that they thought differently and they made a change in the world around them at the time around them. And so join me in thanking not just those free thinkers who certainly deserve to be recognized year after year, but also Tom Eichelman who has put that together for us. And we like to add to that gallery year after year. Sometimes it's one, two, three people. And this year, we are really proud uh, to introduce not just a local person, but a national hero uh, who has made Sacramento her home for the last decade or so. Uh, we've got two to introduce, but the first is Miss Cleo Kosal. Let's turn hers around. She did leave us not too long ago, and she has just been an amazing person. Uh, to have around here in Sacramento a fighter for women's rights and secular rights, uh, an amazing actress and writer and entertainer in all ways. Let's uh, uh, just appreciate Cleo Kosal. And on the national level, a absolute hero for women's rights specifically and those who are non-religious, um, who we can credit to the foundation of the Freedom From Religion Foundation, let's all recognize and thank the efforts of Miss Ann Gaylor. We're going to put these up on display somewhere, and uh, of course they will be part of the gallery from this year forward. And I just want to thank again all of the sponsors, uh, Paul Story, the Original Motto Project, Reason Center, Hagsa, and Mike Newdow, as well as so many others. And, uh, and, and again, thank you for, for making today possible. I know a lot of you also donated and supported this event today. You've signed up for the, for the door, or the, um, uh, the silent auction, you donated at the door, you, you gave money, and thank you. I'm sorry if we couldn't fit you in the program or recognize you last minute, but just from my heart, I really do appreciate your um, willingness to contribute to this event so that we can make this a sustainable thing and have the 16th and the 30th and the 100th Free Thought Day sometime in the future whenever that math works out. So thank you guys for making Free Thought Day happen.